From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us on this Thursday, October 23rd, 2014. In the news, an overheated transformer was the cause for a temporary evacuation at the Noel Wien Library yesterday. Fairbanks Fire and Police Departments responded to the library after occupants said they smelled smoke before the fire alarms went off. Assistant Fire Chief Ernie Mishevitz said they shut down an area of electricity to the transformer and borough maintenance worked to fix the problem. He said the evacuation was precautionary because the fire department was initially unsure of the situation. No plea deal for one of the two men that the village of Tanana is seeking to banish after a double trooper murder. 61-year-old William Walsh appeared in Fairbanks District Court Tuesday for what should have been a change of plea hearing. However, Walsh chose not to take the deal presented to him by the district attorney's office. The DA had offered to drop the charges in exchange for community service hours. Walsh, who was charged with misdemeanor assault and violating felony probation, decided to take his case to trial instead. And the Interior Gas Utility began the procurement process Monday for nearly 80 miles of pipe slated to be installed in the North Pole area this spring during Phase 1 of the Interior Energy Project. The announcement is a major milestone for the municipal-owned utility. An invitation to bid was released on October 20th and bid submissions are due November 18th. Project manager David Prusak says the pipe must be ordered by December of this year in order for installation work to begin this spring. Quick look at the Fairbanks weather. Today partly sunny, highs in the 20s to around 30. Tonight mostly cloudy with lows in the teens to lower 20s. Tomorrow mostly cloudy, highs in the 20s to around 30. Extended forecast mostly cloudy with a chance of snow Saturday through Wednesday and a little bit cooler with highs staying near 20, lows around 10, maybe down to 5 above by Tuesday night. The Aurora forecast is moderate. That's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. Remember, for more news, sports, or weather, you can download our free mobile app for Android and Apple devices. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.